Hello and welcome to Zero to 60. Today we're in a 2009 Holden, Colorado ute. Or pickup for those of you who are outside of Australia. Yes, that's right. And what we're going to do this week is compare it to the D40 that we did last week, the STX. This is the three litre turbo diesel four cylinder. Um, so it should give it a good run. If you don't know, the Holden Colorado is actually the same vehicle as the Isuzu D-Max, just with a very few uh, slight front end differences. That's, that's literally it. Both the Holden Colorado and the Isuzu D-Max were available at the same time in Australia. You know, they had all the different um, dual cab, single cabs, tray back, style side, the whole shebang, both at the same time, which I always thought was a bit weird to sell two vehicles that were the same. Um, now this is the first generation Colorado, or actually really followed on from the Rodeo. It, does. Um, it would be the third generation of this platform, I suppose, for lack of a better word, um, from the Rodeos. Yeah, this particular model is the four-wheel drive dual cam. It's got the five-speed manual with the three-litre turbo diesel. In standard trim, they make 161 horsepower and 360 newton meters of torque. This one, however, has had an ECU chip, a air intake, and a full exhaust. So it's now supposed to make around 200 horsepower and over 500 newton meters of torque. That's pretty good, but it's still not quite as much as the STX 550. No, that's true, but I've got to say, man, it feels aggressive. It, it feels towy. Even just sitting in the passenger seat, I can feel it's an old school diesel, the way it comes on the power. Yeah, it's true, it's not like the, um, not like the, the new navs. But look, I've got no idea what it's supposed to do time-wise. Really interested to find out after having this tune, see if it can get anywhere near that STX. Uh, let's go. Let's go see what it can do. Well, 12 second flat, that's not too bad. No, I was quite good. Um, it's about a second faster than the MP300, but still two seconds off the SDX. Yes, yes, didn't quite get there, did it? You do have to keep in mind that the STX was an automatic, so much better off the line, but well, definitely better gear changes as well, and this thing is a very old school five-speed manual, which even if you could, you don't really want to smash through the gears and do flat shifts. Keeping in mind, the MP300 actually had to change into four to reach 100K, so this was still one shift less than the MP, but yeah, still no water. Yeah, you may notice from the uh, the shots at the start of the video, this has had a two inch lift. It's also got oversized tires on it, which I, they can't help for acceleration. I think they're, I can't remember the exact profile difference, but it's about an inch bigger than the standard tires. Yeah, it's, yeah, it doesn't help with its acceleration times, but it gives it a pretty cool looking stance. It, it looks pretty cool and it helps it when it's off road. Have I've you? actually, so you've taken this off-road, haven't you? Well, I've been, I've been with the owner off-road, and I've got to say, it's actually pretty pretty good. It doesn't really struggle in places you'd think it would. Did you do any hill climbs? Yeah, yeah, obviously the power really helped with, with hills, um, getting up really steep descents, even big potholes and ruts. It doesn't have an issue there, but even the underbody, if you actually have a look, it's like all the important stuff, the exhaust, it's all quite well protected, so you can sort of give it a pretty hard time and it, it doesn't destroy itself, which is good. Yeah, all in all, it's been pretty impressive, especially considering it's done 200,000 Ks now, and I think it's been tuned for that entire time of its life. Holden and Isuzu, you've, you've done well. Well, thanks for watching, guys. Yeah, please don't forget to give it a thumbs up if you like the video. And yeah, feel free to share it with your friends and don't forget to subscribe to the channel for more videos to come. Peace. That's insane. But it's still a slight that's a fit. A desafit. A desafit. That's what, isn't that what you do on Saturday night? <laughs> <laughs> oh, so still a slight. Oh fucking hell! I've got some laugh on. So, st so still a slight. That's pretty good, but it's still a slight deficit. <laughs> fuck off! Oh, fuck off! <laughs> deficit. deficit. I can't. No, I've got to change that word. <laughs> I've got to change that word. All right.
close.